Spray painting camouflage. In today's video, I'll show you how to paint camouflage patterns using these inexpensive stencils that I bought on Amazon. I'll show you the step-by-step -step process, all the products I used, and I'll put affiliate links in the description below so you can paint camouflage just like this. This is my generator noise reduction box that I made in a previous video. I'll link to that video at the end of today's video. This is what we're gonna be painting camouflage. I've already sanded this thing down. Next, I'm gonna mask it all off and then we're gonna spray it with primer. And now it's raining. I'll give this a couple minutes to pass. Hopefully it stops raining here pretty soon. I'm gonna let that primer dry and then I'm gonna give this thing a base coat of color. It looks like it's quit raining uh, for the most part. These are the paints I'm gonna be using. This is the Rust-Oleum Camouflage Series. My base coat, I'm gonna be using the Deep Forest Green. There's our base coat. It's still a little bit wet. We're gonna let this thing dry overnight and then we're gonna hit it again tomorrow. All right, my base coat has had a chance to dry overnight. Now I'm gonna start the stenciling process. I picked up these inexpensive plastic stencils on Amazon. I'll leave an affiliate link for these and other products in the description down below. And if you use it, it'll help out the channel. I've transferred these over to some heavy poster board. This is what I'm gonna use to stencil my camouflage pattern. These stencils make it super easy to make the patterns that you want. To transfer the stencils onto the heavy poster board, I just traced out all of the shapes that I wanted to use for the camouflage. And then to actually cut them out, I just used an X-Acto knife. The first color I'm gonna use is this lighter army green. Next, I'm going to do some aspen leaves and khaki. It's starting to take shape. Now I'm going to switch over to some oak and maple leaves. Now I'm going to go back and put a few khaki maple leaves. How about some dark green ferns? Now I'm just gonna mix and match. All right, I'm gonna let this thing dry and then we'll take a much closer look at it. So what do you guys think about this camouflage paint job? How does it look? Leave a comment and let me know your thoughts. And be sure to check out the build video for this generator quiet box. And thanks for checking out today's video. 